hello and welcome again to my channel today so today we are cooking offada sauce and here to make that i have one bulb of onion three green bell pepper three scotch bonnet and one thumb size of ginger so yeah i've got my pot on fire and i'm going to blend everything together so that's the blend of the pepper mix it's roughly blended together So in the pot, I'll put about two cups of vegetable oil. This step, you could use um, bleach palm oil because that's what is ideally used. But I'm not a fan of bleach palm oil, so this is a substitute for bleach palm oil. So in the oil, once it's hot, you pour in some sliced onion and the sliced onion until it is golden brown. So usually what this does is it cleans up the oil and this step is quite important. So we fry the onions of the golden brown so that I can reduce all its flavor. And yes, the onions have been fried for the past 10 minutes. Now it's all golden brown. And once you get to this stage, then yes, this is the color we want to achieve. Then I pour in my pepper mix. Notice I did not add tomatoes. You can add tomato if you want, but the traditional one, it's usually no tomatoes there. But like I said, you can add green tomato if you want. So I'm going to mix this together and allow it to cook on medium heat. So noticed I used the red um, scotch bonnet. I didn't have a green scotch bonnet, that was why I used the red uh, scotch bonnet. So you could use any, but ideally it's green. So I have an assorted um, meat here. I have um, some gizzard, I have some snails, I have some meat. So I use just assorted meat. So you can use any meat of your choice, any assorted meat. You could add some pomo, that's cow skin. You could add some shaki, that's stripe. Any meat of your choice, assorted meat. So yes, so I'm just mixing that all together. And as you can see, the sauce is cooked because the oil is now on it. So yes, I'm going to add um, my boiled eggs too in there. Gently mix everything together and allow it some time to marry together, to cook well together. So I'm going to cover it again and allow it to cook so that the meat can absorb some of the flavor of the sauce. So yes, it's allowed it to cook for about 10 minutes. So it's been cooking for the past 10 minutes now. And yes, it is ready. It is ready now. Um, I already added, um, and that's the way it is. I already added my spices behind the camera. Sorry, the clip it was lost. So, but I already added it. I just added some bouillon cube and some salt. That's all I added to it. Yes, and it, as you can see, that is our father rice with all sorts of assorted meat and yes that's how it looks thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my channel if you've not done so and i'll see you again with another interesting and delicious meal bye for now bye